Welcome to the Miami Herald Business Show. I'm Nyla Boudou. Last week, female leaders from across the world gathered in Miami Beach for a leadership conference of the International Women's Forum. One of the attendees was Muriel Siebert. She's the president and founder of brokerage firm Muriel Siebert & Co. and was the first woman to own a seat on the New York Stock Exchange. We sat down with her to get her perspective on the financial markets. I happen to have faith in common stocks. Uh, and I believe that the markets will turn. They have turned. They have made up some of the drop. But I do believe that when we see some of our big companies, they're very well spread around the world. They're making money in China. They're making money in the countries that are growing in India. They're making money, you know, our companies, our large companies, have truly become global. And some of them were at such historical lows. Well, your bigger companies, your Pfizer's, your, your Merck's, you know, they're going to be around in five years from now. They're not going out of business. I would say probably the continuation of computers and everything associated with it. Uh, Probably communications will be there. Um, we, we are now a service industry. You know, our manufacturing is way down. Uh, I think we could keep our lead in drugs and pharmaceuticals, which will grow as a population ages. We're not coming out with, you don't see the companies opening, they can't get the financing. We have to make sure that if somebody wants to open a company, that there is money available. If the idea is good, it's solid. It's a hard problem. Um, I can't give you a date. The first thing I would look for is for unemployment to stop climbing. We expect it to hit 10%. And that 10% is really low because there are people that have stopped looking for jobs. Thanks for watching. For the Miami Herald Business Show, I'm Nyla Boodoo.